Hello everybody and welcome back to Stardew Valley! Today, um, I'm gonna hang on to the geode, but it's, I could've also sold the daffodil. I'm smart. Um, okay, I'm gonna want extra food items today. Because we are going back into the mines. I'll bring the bread rolls. Um, seems like a good idea. Oh, we have more mail. Dear neighbor, if you're feeling settled in your new home, I'm writing you to know to let you know that Pierre, Pierre's store is now selling fertilizers. Why don't you swing by and see if you can afford a few dozen boxes or so? I would, but fertilizer is something you need to use before you plant crops, and I, my farm is already full of planted crops, so. And I'm going to re hoe that spot because it's going to bug me if it's not filled in. There we go. I know that was a bit of wasted energy, and I really shouldn't have, but it would have bothered me if I wouldn't have filled it back in. I should just plant something there, but I'm waiting for the potatoes to be done to see how much longer we have left. Because if there's enough time left, I'm just going to get even more potatoes. If there's not, I'm going to just plant um, parsnips. Right, our dog. We don't want to forget about our doggo. There's my good boy. You know, I'm gonna head up to the top this time. I love how he, when he wags his tail, it makes a little thunking noise. More salmon berries. And that's kind of why I went up through the top, is to see if there were salmon berries up here. Which we will probably start eating those today. And because we don't have to wait around for nine, we'll have a bit of extra time at the uh, mines, I would hope. Because, I mean, there's no way gathering this is going to take an hour. Just that single salmon berry. Now, let us see. So you might, as I have mentioned before, and you, you'll definitely see now, the floors are randomized. This is different from the last time we were here. So just keep that in mind if you're exploring, because, you know, you can't just go, Oh, well, I've already been through here. I know how to get out, because, nope, it's different every time. Which is nice, because it means that you can actually gather resources rather effectively. It also means that the boxes will reappear. Which I'm actually just taking a quick peek to see if there's boxes. Actually, I think this floor is the same design as it was last time. No way B, I don't care. I'm just gonna go down a floor. There we go. They might be... It's hard to tell if they're randomized, because a lot of the floors do look very similar. Hey, there's a way down. It's being very nice to us. Um, I feel I should show, really quick, if we come over here to the crafting part, a staircase takes 99 stone, and it just moves you down a level. You basically build your own ladder down. Which makes sense. And a lot of the times, I would normally carry them with me, but we don't have enough extra stone, so... I'm not going to bother with them, because we don't have stone to spare currently. And I'm just going to ignore that one bit of copper. We have so much copper. Yeah, I think last time it was the 29th floor that was monster infested. So this is definitely a different design. So yeah, it is random. Basically, a monster-infested floor means that you have to kill all of the monsters on the floor to go down to the next floor. And I am not good at combat. As you've probably guessed and seen... Okay, there's no other monsters over there. Make 
sure there isn't a diglet up here. Okay, there isn't. I mean, these floors can be nice because, well, they don't require you to, uh, have, um, like, use much energy. That's what I was trying to say and completely forgot. And this is just kind of open. I think that was a floor that had coal on it before, which is why that's open now. Hey, a cave carrot. Those boxes can be so lucrative. Unlike actual loot boxes. Oh hey, some amethyst. That'll let me see if that's actually something Abigail likes. Bugger. Oh, come on, just get down here, B. Stop wasting time. You know you're just gonna die. Just accept it, B. Our current boots are one defense, one immunity. What are these ones like? One immunity. Ours are better! Got it! So I can just sell those ones. I don't think they're actually worth anything. Cave Garrett. You know what? I'm just gonna go down a floor. And I think I'm gonna eat some bread. I meant to eat some bread. And now I believe we're at a new type of the uh, mines. Yep, there's definitely new enemies here. That is a bat we hear. It's like a bee, but with more health. Like, significantly more health. Which is part of the advantage of having this sword. There's also these, which are golems of some description. They also have a lot of health. Now we generated a staircase. And there doesn't appear to be anything else here, so we may as well just take the staircase. Hey, a box. Two cave carrots. That is nice. We are getting a lot of cave carrots. We're up to six, which is tasty. Let's mine away a bit more copper, I guess. I think all of the rocks, like standard rocks here, will... No, oh, they still only take one hit. Okay. I was going to say, I think they'll take two hits now, but that must be later on. Ooh, that is a different type of geode. I want that. That is an omni-geode. You know what, I'm gonna eat the other bit of bread, just to clear out another inventory space. And we could still use that energy, so... If I could find a way down, that'd be great. Way down? Oh, it's another one of these guys. Yeah, I'm not exactly the best at fighting. They also have a lot of health. They're like stone golems. And they, they just have health for days, and I'm terrible at fighting them. And yeah, I'm not great at the combat in this game. <laughs> the combat is super simple, though. Which is something I like. Which is probably partially why I'm bad at it. Because it is super simple. So I don't try. Oh, I'm just looking for the way down, Mr. Bat. I know there's a chance you might give me the way down, but I don't want to fight you, Mr. Bat. Oh, one right here. I'm an idiot. I just didn't see it. Another cave carrot. If 
that was on screen, you were probably anyone watching this is probably just screaming at me. There's a way down right there. Yeah, I know I'm an idiot. I'm not great at seeing things. Ooh, okay. Inventory full. Let's let's dump the sap. Eight to twelve plus two speed plus one defense. Four to eight. This is a better sword. We now have the forest sword. Now I would ditch our old sword, but I kind of want to hang on to it just for sent sentimental values. Plus, it was a reward for getting to a floor. So I'm, I'm gonna hang on to it. You don't have to, but I'm going to. It doesn't do anything to hang on to it. There's a way down. If I find a way down, I'm just gonna go down. Because it's getting kind of late in the day. Ooh, more amethyst. I, I, I will gladly take more amethyst. Everyone could use more amethyst in their lives. I've already made that joke once before. It's not even really a joke. It's more just a fact. Barrel. More cave carrots. Yeah, this thing is so much better. And it does swing faster, too. And here's a way down. Ding! I might as well check out this floor while we're here. Hey, there's a way down. And yeah, those things can hurt you if you walk into them like an idiot, like I just did. Ah, uh, inventory's full, right. Um... These spring onions, then. Let's finally clear away our spring onions. I could just throw away the daffodil, I suppose, but... I mean, this will help us recover some energy. And we definitely do need more stone. A few of the upgrades for our house will take stone as well, so... Hey, there's another way down. Uh, I'm just gonna keep plunging further down. I'm not going to be as lenient at looking for things, because, I mean, if I can just get to another five, that would be nice. Because we have a lot of copper, and we know where we can get copper. So, it's not exactly vitally important that we keep gathering copper. There are other materials we can get further down, and even from these enemies, such as that, which... I'll get rid of the algae for... Oh, there was two things there. The algae and the daffodil, I guess. Right there is iron ore. That is one of the things I am hoping to find. We can't do anything with it yet, but we're gonna want it, so... Okay, there's no... Just way down there. Oh, yeah, way down. Oh, hey, coal. And <laughs> it's right here. Yes! Okay, um... I'm gonna kill these. More iron ore, that's always nice. Okay. We may as well just leave, because... We don't have enough time to get down more floors. Now, we have a ton of geodes for tomorrow. So, that'll be nice. Like, that is... We have a lot of geodes. We have eight normal, and we have the Omni Geode. So, in the, with, with a lot of luck, we will have enough for some things. Uh, that's the wrong way. Tomorrow, we will not be heading back into the mines, because we've done that for two days in a row now. Uh, is there anything on here? Uh, any quartz? To rub on his sore back. No, purely because it's alternative medicine and you should not be doing that. Just go to the doctor. That's what the doctor is there for, Clint. Jeez. More salmon berries. You can actually find those around town as well. 
I'm, I'm partially going to be just looking for those tomorrow. There's a uh, forging skill you can get that'll make it so you can harvest two berries at a time, and I plan on getting that. Okay. Bug meat. Quartz. Slime. Earth crystal. Not selling the amethyst. I will sell the topaz and the bat wings. And that looks like everything. Now, we're going to put our old sword away. I'm going to write the boots. I'm going to sell the boots. And put the cave carrots away. The coal away. Stone. Fiber. Copper ore. Iron ore. Oh, we already had some iron ore. But we didn't even have any yet. I guess we did. Actually, I'm going to keep the salmon berries on me as the just generic healing item. Because cave carrots are a little good for that. They're just a little bit better than... Um, the salmon berries. I don't even think we can... No, we can't even sell the boots. Okay, never mind. I'll store them then, I guess. Because I have nothing else to do with them. And now we better hop into bed. Combat up! And we made... Uh, almost 500 gold. <laughs> Mining is not a good way of making money. But with that, that is it for today's Stardew Valley. I hope to see you back tomorrow as we process those geodes and hunt for salmon berries. So, see you all then.